we've absolutely nailed our colours to the mast with one clear overarching aim, to end extreme poverty in our world. Over a billion people still live on less than $1.25 a day. Getting to the point where no one at all is that poor is no longer a pipe dream. It can and should be one of the great achievements of our time. It is doable. And it means that by 2030, everyone will have what we in Britain already consider our birthright. Drinking water, electricity, health care, and a place at school. Our report will make clear that we need to tackle the causes of poverty, not just the symptoms. Above all, we need a focus on economic growth, driven by a strong private sector as the most powerful engine there is to lift people out of poverty. We need a recognition that development has to be sustainable for the planet for the long term. But there's this new commitment to strong institutions and governance, because these are essential to end conflict, to protect the rule of law, to stamp out corruption and insecurity, and to hold governments accountable. Finally, we agreed that our report must be clear, it must be compelling, it must be accessible, so people around the world, including thousands who've contributed their views, can debate it, can implement it, and can demand action from us all. So we'll be finalising clear and challenging goals, and we'll be setting out illustrative examples of the goals we should believe, believe should be there, and what should succeed the Millennium Development Goals after 2015.